Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. We are on day four on Chrome Seas, and we've just arrived in. Well, not just we slept no, in. We slept in again. Um, New Mia. Which is <laughs> nice. We're in New Mia. We are in New Mia today. We are going to uh, go and grab some breakfast quickly, and then head down. When you are in New Mia, you end up at the normal cargo port. I'll just show you this quickly. It's very, very bright out here. So you can see sort of the main port area. This is where these larger ships come into. Spin you back around. So this is, um, uh, yeah, we, you have to actually get on a bus. Yes, yeah. so it's a complimentary bus that um, you have to be on. You can't walk off the ship and into town. You have to get on this bus and travel into town. It's an unplanned, mm. simple day. A couple of little ideas on what we might do. So come along, enjoy the fun. <laughs> Let's go to Numia. Welcome to Numia. <laughs> I need to teach you to use this, don't I? Yeah, probably. <laughs> All right, so we've just hopped off um, the bus that you get when you get off the ship. So it's the courtesy bus that we told you about. So we've just jumped off that. Um, and now we're here at the, um, this is the uh, Maritime Ferry Cruise Terminal. So this is where the smaller ships um, dock in. But obviously we're on a bigger ship, so we have to dock a little bit away so that's literally not even five minutes not even five in. minutes no so this is where um they do all the markets and stuff so there's a heap up the top there which yeah okay i don't know how to use this thing <laughs> yeah all right, all right well, let's just give the tech back to I'll, matt oh I'll, I'll film <laughs> okay so yes up the top is there we're saying there's markets up the top there this is the uh Ooh. the ferry terminal now Interesting, just a little fact. Last time we were here, all the tour operators were out yeah. to the left as you looked at the building. They're Today right, they're out right. to the right. Yeah, so we'll, we'll, we'll go and suss we'll that out. Look at what's over there. Get up, Look how good she is, putting my sun cream on for me. <laughs> oh, she's a loving wife. Oh, don't want to hear you whinging later. <laughs> <laughs> Self-preservation, is it? <laughs> exactly it. Are you going to do my neck too? <gasps> she's doing my neck. Yay. Yay. All right. I think Yay. we're all sunscreened up. Let's, uh... I'm nice and greasy. Let's go and um, explore. Explore in your mirror. Now that we're sun creamed up, you creamed me, baby. How to put Namia into words? Not really sure how to put Namia into words, right, Deb? Uh, look, there's some beautiful water surrounding it. <laughs> look, I'm, I'm, I'm keen to see. Like, we're going to go and have a look at the World One War, World War One Museum. Two. I'm sure he said one. It's two. He was confused, it's two. <laughs> right. Okay, two. Um, so, yeah, keen to have a look at that. I think there's some little gems, like, you know, we've done the the lookout in past videos. Yes. So, I mean, obviously that's a go-to for everyone because it's just absolutely beautiful up there. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, it's... I mean, what day of the week is it? Saturday. Saturday. But it's East Saturday. True. So... A lot of these island communities <laughs> still have strong yeah, Christian roots from the missionaries back in the day. But uh, we're uh, here now. I think, yeah, it's confusing. It, it feels it feels <laughs> forgotten, neglected. Yeah. It's like the poor the poor cousin that France forgot to you know, tidy up. Yeah, it's got some little hit, hidden gems, but yeah, it's just looking very tired. But here we are. So we've walked. It's only taken us what? Not even ten minutes. No. The, uh, we'll probably put on there's that other museum right over there. World War II Museum. So we're going to go in here and Uzi take a look. There we go. I'm not even going to pretend to speak I'm very French. excited. I've heard a lot of good recommendations about this place, so I'm very keen to see. Oh man, it's stuck in here. Ooh. I'm very keen to see how this uh, this looks. And look, you <laughs> greet it straight away by, by displays. So this is a Pratt and Whitney. Uh, 
engine mm. from an American air. Anyway, mm. we'll go and have a look. Good. This is the World War II Museum. Bonjour. Oh, thank you. part of the daily vlog and that um, we've just finished at the World War II Museum really cool place fantastic place yeah fantastic. yeah very informative um, lots of memorabilia yep. um, really cool system of even with the kids can interact yeah. Noah was given medicine to a boy via a, a computer screen and making him better and had to choose which medicine so that was kind of cool but yeah. interactive for the kids as well nicely air conned the iPads were a great touch yeah, no, that and was really to good. To help and, translate uh, with what was it, 600 eight. for the three of us. 600 in the local currency yes. will throw what that a is. conversion <laughs> on the screen. But um, yeah, they give you an iPad. It has uh, sign language on it, uh, as well as written text, uh, as well as um, audio translations in French, English, Japanese, mm. and a couple of other languages. So really cool spot. And sort of to show you where it is, like if you walk out here, it's, we it's can going, actually going out on the street, see, going out, follow Noah. If we come out and turn left. Okay, actually, yeah, this is good. Let's just do this. This just will show you how close it actually is to where we started. Yep. We might fasten this up in freezing. <laughs> right. All right, ready for fast forwarding? Ready, Fast forwarding, start. ready, Running. go. Go. Counter is 122. The counter on this video clip now says three minutes and twenty two seconds now. All right, so we've just Got on to the World War II Museum, and there's Quantum over in the background. So it just shows you Jeez. how tight and compact this uh, main area of New Caledonia really is. So we're going to head a bit further up the road there. There's a little brown and white shrine where you can see in the distance there at the moment over near the water. That's the Maritime Museum. I'm going to go and touch that out. But to give you context, but, uh, we get to the end here. Okay, yep, we've got something else to show you too. My apologies. And we look down the road. So, all right, I can't give a landmark as to where we were dropped off. It's down uh, there on the right where those buses are. Yeah, you can see the buses just down in the distance there. We got to work out where we're crossing, crossing over there. But there's some buses down there. Just so you know, if you were to do that, you could come back this way and then turn down Avenue Port Dumont. And then it's um, just a block that way. Not very far to go at all. Not very far to go at all for the museum. And then, yeah, so. Good job, Deb. Good job. Good job, good job. Good job, Noah. Hi. Is it the casino? New Mia? The New Mia bingo. 
Center. I love this artwork. It looks fabulous. Devon now they turn left instead of turning right. Did you just poke your tongue at me? Yeah, Dad. Looks like they might have been doing some Easter stuff here. Marquee set up. Palm Sunday. Some Easter egg signs. Maybe one of the local churches doing something or did something for Easter Sunday. It was Easter weekend. Oh my God, that's like literally the bus right there. Why do we have to walk all the way back? <laughs> so this is a crazy thing, what Deb's just saying. If you look over there, there's buses. They're coming out of the port terminal right now from the quantum of the seas. In here. And we actually have to walk all the way back, which is not far, it's only a five minute walk. Ten minutes. Maybe ten, probably ten. But yeah, considering that we only literally have to go there. But we have to walk ten minutes away to get back on one of those buses. <laughs> but anyway, let's see. So Tara here for the Marine Museum. Seven hundred F for an adult, drunk. For adults, concessions are 350, 1400 for a family. There's a really annoying fly at the moment. So it's about double the price of. Double the price of the World War II Museum. Well, actually, more. We got all three for 600, that's one adult, 700. Holy crap! This place won't be worth it. I know, right? Anyway, I All have right. no idea what that actually converts to an Australian. It's on your screen now. But uh, look, there's at least one thing that you can see for free. It's a buoy. There you go. We've lost Noah. He's inside already. <laughs> Let's go find Noah at the <coughs> Nimea <coughs> Maritime Museum. Yes, please. Here is the flyer presentation of your museum. On the ground floor, you have a four spaces to visit for permanent exhibition, and on the floor, there is a temporary exhibition of La Monique. Okay, great. Thank you very much. Have a good visit. <coughs> Yeah.
and there we go. The bar. We're finishing up now at I'm the. Go I'm going to go dark. <laughs> Deb, Deb, Deb's giving me lighting directions. It's good. She's learning to direct these videos. Um, We've just so done the Maritime Museum. Maritime Museum. So a bit of footage here. Some really interesting exhibitions today. Yeah, yeah, loved it, loved it. It, um, lots of history, lots of history in here. Mm. Uh, so if you're, if you're interested in well, this, this one, this this one here, this this whole upstairs section is all about a, a missing ship called Le Monique, which went missing in '53. And uh, despite numerous attempts, the only thing that they've come across, I think, is a a, a life a life ring, one life ring. So mm. and quite tragic quite a tragic story there so mm. look this is a really interesting place like yep. lots of history yeah exactly right so that's uh that's uh it for the maritime museum as part of this mm -hmm. vlog uh, make sure you keep some hit and subscribe and we'll see you in the next part of the vlog and we'll see you also in a full video review of the maritime museum but clicking the fingers and going to the next part of the vlog now so just over here you can just see the Choo Choo train. So this is uh, just outside the Maritime Museum. And this is actually the booked tour. So the bus from the ship just pulled up and a group of people have just got on this bus and um, they're heading off now. So you can book this particular tour um, directly with Royal Caribbean or, or with any cruise line and uh, most of them tend to offer it as a package. A lot more expensive doing it this way, booking it through the cruise ship, as opposed to uh, booking it when you're here. And where we're going, where that big white top is that you can see there, that's where we're gonna walk back to and we're gonna get the uh, free shuttle. shuttle. Back to here. <laughs> we're gonna get the shuttle back to here. <clears throat> um, yeah, look, you can do the choo-choo train hop on hop off trains uh and as we saw the prices were sort of 10 to 15 dollars per person should we bring our son should we bring the son the son's up there oh you mean that one that one that one over there yo noah yo bye just a boy and some rocks don't need to pay for entertainment just need a boy with some rocks. it looks beautiful doesn't it it's beautiful water here bit of a windy day yeah not as windy as it's been on the ship though Alright, uh, we'll uh, walk back around and get on the shuttle back to the ship, get some lunch. Noah is keen for a swim. Love you. And uh, later this afternoon, where's Noah? There he is. Alright, he's gone. There's Noah. Alright, Noah's behind me. Noah's talking through his, his actions for iFly. Give your mum the forks. Don't do that. Oh, you're talking in iFly signals. Yeah, this one, so, this one, this one, this one. So we're just on our way back, but when you get into New Mia, yeah. where the shuttle buses drop you off, there is... There's a different? long line of restaurants here, um, all sorts of different cuisines, but it is absolutely packed here. So it is, and it's full of locals. Um, so it's clearly like a, a place that the locals come. It's on Saturday, so everyone's obviously just, you know, coming down here for their brunches, lunches like we would do. Um, and even saw a, a bride back there, so clearly having a bit of a wedding. But yeah, what a beautiful place. The smell was gorgeous. Yeah, so we've seen an it Italian place. We've seen a brasserie, an Asian, a French Asian. Um, places selling cocktail, yeah. uh, dessert. bakery, dessert place. Yeah. So I mean, clearly you could come down here and um, have some lunch and look at the beautiful scenery out there if you wish. But um, yeah, what a lovely little place. Yeah. And it's literally right next to where the markets are, where we've been dropped off. Yeah, so... Looking at the road, you literally turn left. Literally just over here is... What's oh, Noah looking at ice creams? Noah's found some ice creams. Double caramel. Double caramel. Wow. Yeah, so... There you go, that's uh, that's uh, yeah, a nice spot if you wanted to just, you know, enjoy some nice views. Want to have a nice beer there have too. A, have a beer on the water, which you do on the ship anyway, but uh, <laughs> if you want it, 
It's a nice, uh, nice food option for you here in uh, New Mill. Oh, food options, I should say, because yeah, plenty of restaurants to, to choose from. And this is the courtyard where we were before looking at different things. So as you can see, $15 AU for the hop on hop off bus, the train tour bus. Uh, train tour and buses are similar. So uh, yeah, there's, and there's plenty of them when you first arrive in the morning. It's getting to a bit after lunch now or just on lunchtime. So we're going to head out here and head up to the uh, ship. What? Noah, did you just say you didn't want to rush back to the ship? Yeah. yeah. You want to go to the markets? All right. All right. No filming at the markets, remember? Edit, edit, edit. Okay, I can't say that. I've just cut something out. But uh, yes, we're going to go and have a look <laughs> upstairs in the shopping mall markets because Noah requested it. You had a request. I thought you. This is true. See, so we realised that Noah didn't bring a shirt for a tropical night. So Noah, or, um, so we're just grabbing him a shirt for tropical night and a wristband because he just saw a nice wristband he liked to with shells. Take that one. <laughs> Thank you. That way. Yeah. Happy boy. Yep. Yeah. Um, standing in the in the sun. So. So we were going to uh, jump on the bus straight back to the ship, but now I wanted to divert and have a look at the market, so we did. That's all good. But now there's a huge line for the uh, shuttle bus back to the ship. Good news is one just turned up and it looks like one, maybe two more are on the way. So we'll get in the line now. And see how long this actually takes and I'll let you know because this is actually the first time I've seen seen a line like this. There's normally buses waiting and just turning over so we'll see how we go. Look at this. I'll save you. So that was actually really quick. Within minutes we had uh, well not even a minute I reckon it was probably two minutes we had uh, two new buses pull up and one's just pulled out and filled up as well so Three buses in total within a matter of two minutes and everyone's very quickly getting on them. The line's moving fairly smoothly and we'll be back on the ship in just a moment. And so within 10 minutes we are back on the ship. Yes. We're about to jump in the lift and head up. Go and Being offload our goods. Like offload our gear. Looks like someone. I oh, know, bro. Look at, look at that, bro. Look at that. Somebody spilled their coke. So that's uh, like the babysitting uh, service. Nursery service. That's oh. very cute. Yeah, That'd be a pretty cool job. Deb, do you oh, want to become a mama? Let's do that. Become a cruise mama? Yeah, let's do oh, that. So yeah, that was... Oh, anyway, that was our, our new Mia stop. Two stops, a bit of an adventure, a bit of a walk around. Where do you go? Yeah, uh, and back on the ship, we're going to drop off is? all of our gear. What's the time? One thirty. One thirty. And drop off all of our gear back in the room. Go get some. Get a cold drink. Get some things recharging, and uh, go and get a cold drink. Get some lunch, and no one wants to go for a swim. And then Nora and I, as mentioned, have iFly 
this afternoon we're doing complimentary key session which will be lots of fun so we've got to be up there at four o'clock so not a lot of time to squeeze a lot more in <laughs> on you this day we can do it <laughs> we got this we got this see you in the next bit Did I fly again? I missed out because there is a maximum weight, but there's also a height ratio. So I was a little uh, too short for my height. If I was an inch taller, I actually would have been fine weight-wise. So a bit of an odd thing, but that's their safety ratios that they have. How did you go with iFly? Did you love it? Again, yes, I did. And so do you think the key is worth that? Yeah. yeah. And even if we had to pay for it, it'd still be worth it? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm not paying for it. <laughs> cheeky, cheeky. So there you go. I fly another great big success for Noah. Are you looking forward to doing it again on our next cruise in a couple of months? Yeah. You're going to be one of those acrobatic experts like nope. we just saw by the end of 18 days. I'm going to be doing it once. Oh, I don't know. If I do it twice, I won't be like them. All right, so there you go. Noah's had a ball. iFly was fun. And off for the next part of the day now. I don't know where we're going. The pool. The pool? You're going to the pool? Yeah. I'm going to go get a hot dog. Let's go and try a hot dog. Oh, oh, oh look at that. The, the chorizo in there. Good evening from day four. Yeah, day four it, it is, is today. still day four. Yeah, it is still day uh, four. We've been to Numea today. It's been a wonderful day. We got back. Yep. After uh, visiting the uh, the World War II Museum and the Maritime Museum. Mm -hmm. Lovely walk uh, around, looking at a bit of history, which is really cool. Onto the ship pretty quick, and we chilled for the afternoon. Yeah, really. well, I went and hung out at the pool with Noah for. Like, yeah, it was nearly a couple of hours actually yeah, that yeah. Um, we were hanging out at the pool. Um, yeah, and then we just pretty much came back and had a dinner in American Icon tonight. It was English night. Um, although they forgot my Yorkshire pudding, so I had to ask them to go and get my Yorkshire pudding. So. Yeah, your Yorkshire pudding to go with your roast. I did get that. So, yes. I had um, a really nice fish and chips. That was. Yeah, what that was no, no. I have. No, I had the, uh, oh, the Alfredo. Oh, the Alfredo. The Alfredo. Yeah. So, yeah, lovely, so, yeah. just simple, yep. heartwarming type food tonight, which is not too bad because it's actually been a little bit cool. Once we left Numea, the mm. temperature's really dropped tonight. Yeah, yeah, I am uh, actually feeling quite we've, a we've little bit cool We've both got jackets on. Yeah. So, yeah, uh, dinner, and then it's really just been a chill evening. We have so. literally not done a lot this no. evening, so... Which is really good because this is an important point. You can do a hell of a lot on a cruise, mm -hmm. or you can do bugger all. You you do have to stop. You do. You do. So we literally have just been lying in the room for a little while as well, watching movies of like not movies, but the um, the making of the icon of the seas and um, things yeah, like really that. Cool. So um, and watching the belly flop competition from yesterday, I think that they filmed on board. That's yep. now on a channel that you can only watch on board. So that was a bit entertaining, actually, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, and it literally, we just thought we'd go for a, a late night little quick wander. Um, Noah's yeah. gone to bed. He's waiting for the Easter Bunny to arrive. Um, so yeah, we just thought we'd go for a little bit of a wander. Give him some time to actually go to sleep. And, so, um, and then, then yeah. we'll off to Mystery Island tomorrow. So it'll be an early-ish morning, although yeah. we don't knock dock till nine, but still. 
Yeah, so um, we'll be with the with, uh, we'll be getting off and go to Mystery Island. Mm. Bit of snorkeling. You're thinking about maybe getting a massage. Maybe I will. Maybe. Yeah, we'll we'll find out. We'll I'll do go a and bit. See. Go and explore a bit <laughs> so, more of Mystery Island. Um, yeah, we love snorkeling. It's always number one, and uh, we'll just see how we're going for time as to what other activities we do for the day. Thanks for tuning again. Yeah, we uh, we really love it. Uh, a shout out again to Darren. I think he's stalking us. Uh, one of our channel subscribers. He we, might uh, say the same about we, us. So, sorry, like, like three or four times, like turn a corner, there's Darren. Yeah. So g'day again, Darren, and to uh, hi to you and your family. Yeah. We will uh, see you no doubt again on this cruise. <laughs> and uh, if you are a subscriber, come and say g'day to us. If you do see us around, we'd love to say hello and yeah. have a chat. So Absolutely. Have a great day. Thank you again. Hit the like hit the subscribe, hit the notify bell. And happy and we'll, early Easter. And we'll see you in the next <laughs> video.